Suicides and bribery. Sounds like a soap opera, but it's actual reality. Sung Wong Jung, a South Korean businessman, hung himself from a tree last week. A note found in his pocket listed eight politicians and the sums with which he had allegedly bribed them. South Korean President Park Gwen Hae faces allegation, faced allegations Wednesday that members of her administration had been receiving bribes, including the country's Prime Minister, Lee Wong Koo. Now, he hung himself with a tie on a tree. He was being investigated himself. We can say he did it in shame. Now prosecutors have launched an investigation into the corruption scandal involving the President Park's closest aides. And it brings up a lot of questions about how people are elected in Korea, mm -hmm. the money that it takes, the things that are going on under the table. But it kind of, you know, it makes me kind of think, well, the way that we do it here, it's not that different. Through the Citizens United, we, we have super PACs that are allowed to give undisclosed amounts of money, right. you know, to certain campaigns. Not directly, but basically, what's the difference? Because who are funding the people here in America? Wealthy, wealthy businessmen who did it in South Korea, same thing. Bribery versus funding, what's the difference? I mean, there's no difference. Right. We still live in a world where you have to pay to play. Mm -hmm. And although in the last elections, at least here in the U.S., we've seen uh, a growth in the small donation aspect. Mm -hmm. You know, we have PayPal. We have electronically set up um, ways to, for you to donate. Re the reality is that still today, the, 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 the thing shifts with the big donations. The big donations... There are a possibility because of the super PAC that make um, using money without restrictions for specific electorate causes. I don't see it being very different. But at the same time, I have to take this with a hint because we don't know the reality of this case. This guy mm -hmm. could have been, you know, murdered or something. Murdered or something. Ah, so and shady so maybe, you know, I don't know. The thing is that. There's too little information to claim that this is a real deal because there was only a note in a pocket. Jose's been watching a little too many Mexican soap operas, but let's get back to this. Mr. Sung said in an interview before he killed himself, he admitted to giving $183,000 to what he was thinking would be something that would help Ms. Park win the election. That is seen as a bribe. But it, in America, we do the exact same thing. That's the only reason why I'm saying, you know, it's considered a bribe. You give money, hey, forget about this, let this happen. But in America, you give money, and it's, it's the exact same thing. It's just not illegal. We just do it in a legal well, it's way. It's happening so, right now with Senator Menendez. Exactly. He's facing this big scrutiny. He's facing charges because of something that could be equiparated with this, that it's his relationship with a donor and the favors that he did or not for him. Right. Well, we want to know what you guys have to say about this. It's very interesting, really scandalous, crazy thing. Like I said, it is something straight from a soap opera. We want to know what you guys have to say. And please, if you haven't already, subscribe to the Lip TV too for more.